You may have noticed when looking at laptop specs that some product pages don't seem to mention if the RAM is single or dual channel. All you're presented with is the total size of RAM. You're left wondering, 16 gigs? Is that two sticks of eight gigs or one stick of 16 RAM? Once you figure out if it's one stick of RAM, you'll be left asking if it's started to the motherboard and if there's another SODIMM slot for an upgrade. You won't know until you do a little digging or you have the laptop in your hands to take a look for yourself. In a lot of cases, you'll find your new gaming laptop is sporting single channel with room for upgrading. Upgrading the RAM, the hard drive or SSD are the only upgrades you can do on most laptops. Today, we're gonna see if upgrading to a dual channel RAM setup in your laptop is worth it, with a gaming focus, of course. Once upon a time, deep in the Memory Express tech bay, our builder Russ was cheerfully testing out laptops for reviews when he noticed the benchmarks didn't seem to be scaling with different quality settings. Like you expect to see with an i7 combined with an RTX 2060. For example, in Overwatch, on low settings, he was hitting 128 FPS, high 108, and ultra 95 FPS. Typically, you expect to see greater scaling when switching between quality settings. He started digging and digging, as any good tech head would, and hypothesized that either thermal throttling or single channel RAM is the cause of this discrepancy. He grabbed not one, but two popular gaming brands with similar specs the MSI GS65 Stealth and the ASUS ROG Strix SCAR 2. The MSI is a thin and light 15.6 gaming beauty. The ASUS is a 17 rugged thick boy with some beastly cooling. The reasoning for the choice of models was to rule out thermal throttling as a cause for low scaling between quality settings. And while these are different manufacturers and there are some variants between them, they exhibit the same behaviors of performance scaling. So thermal throttling did not seem to be the issue. So we benched, and we benched, and we benched, and populated the second sodium slot, and benched some more. While we're waiting for the benches, now seems like a good time to quickly go over single versus dual channel RAM. Single channel is one stick of RAM in the dim slots of your motherboard. Dual channel is running two sticks of RAM off your motherboard when your motherboard supports dual channel. It's common in gaming and workstation laptops to support dual channel RAM. What does Dual give you? Well, Dual Channel allows another parallel channel that your PC can use simultaneously with your first stick of RAM to lessen the load and double your bandwidth. For example, if you're using two 8GB sticks in dual slots versus one 16GB slot, you'll have two streams of data your CPU can use to send the RAM instead of one, less than bottlenecking of your CPU sending information to the RAM. Both laptops have a single channel 16GB stick of RAM. So with the idea of upgrading your laptop, we're adding HyperX Impact 16GB DDR4 2666MHz SODA RAM for a total of 32GB, and we'll see how that affects your FPS and performance scaling when gaming on your laptop. When choosing the RAM up for upgrading, we want to make sure it's the same capacity and frequency. This helps eliminate any problems that may occur with mismatched RAM. Both laptops were updated with the latest BIOS, and both had their fan speed set to max. Otherwise, it's straight out of the box benchmarks. We benched a wide array of games at different settings, low, high, and max settings. Then we ran benchmarks again with a second SODIMM slot populated and the results were astonishing. There was a huge jump when gaming on low with all the games we benched and still quite a significant jump for high and max settings. The performance scaling was acting more normally too. As you can see, both laptops ran quite similarly as they should with such similar specs and both laptops benefited greatly from the dual channel RAM. The max jump we got was an 83% FPS increase on ultra settings in Overwatch, an overall average of 30 to 40% increase in the system performance across the board. When looking at some synthetic benchmarks, there's less of an increase, all below 10%. Don't let this fool you though. These tests don't rely as much on the bandwidth as real-time gaming will. If you're a creator who's using Adobe's RAM-hungry applications, the upgrade in RAM size will also benefit your creative endeavors. More RAM allows you to easily have multiple applications running while you switch between your projects without any slowdown. We were surprised at the performance you gained from dual channel combined with increasing the RAM capacity. Again, lots of gaming laptops out there ship with single channel 16 gigabyte, making it easier and cheaper to upgrade your RAM to dual channel 32 gigabyte. And if you feel like your current gaming laptop is lagging behind, check to see if you have an extra SODIMM slot available. Dual channel might just be what you need to refresh your laptop or if you want the absolute best of your brand new laptop, you may want to consider picking up a matching RAM stick 
so you too can dual channel your way through those high frame rates per second. If you're curious about upgrading your laptop RAM, it's as easy as coming down to your friendly neighborhood memory express and our knowledgeable staff can help you figure out if your laptop is upgradable. If it is possible, Memory Express has service to complete the installation for you and you won't have to worry about disassembling your laptop. Fees may vary depending on the laptop model. All right, guys, don't forget to follow us on social media. Facebook and Twitter are the same at Memory Express and our official Instagram is official Memory Express. Thank you again, Fractal Design, for the MEXP prize this month. We're giving away a Meshify S2 case as well as Prisma case fan. Just comment an area of the month of May and you have a chance to win these fabulous prizes. I'm Steve from Memory Express, and I'd like to know in the comments below if you want more videos of deep diving the potential upgrades for your tech life. Let me know. We'll see you guys at Autofest. Do you think people would accept my new personality of Professor Steve, like Professor Hulk? Yes. I view this as an absolute win. It's a good meme.